Welcome back to the tutorial for this for my world. Um, the next level I'm going to show off is not Y3 because we don't want to go there yet. Uh, the next level we want to do is Y1 just because for a glitch we need for the castle. And this is the reason too why we want to grab Yoshi in Y2. So let me try to show that off or let me show it off. Let me do a save thing here. So first of all, we want to grab this fire flower here. <coughs> so you want to try to lose as little P speed as possible, because well, this is speed run and you don't want to lose P speed. There's a way where you don't lose P speed at all, <coughs> but it's really hard and pretty inconsistent. Not really worth it, because the main reason for you don't want to go too fast is if you eat it too fast then Yoshi is just swallowing it and then you don't get the fire flower and well that's stupid so eat the scooper so you don't crush it grab the fire flower try to not lose uh, to not lose too much P speed and then it's just pretty forward not bonking into the pipes <coughs> Like this does adjust the method I'm doing, it's pretty consistent. And the funny part comes comes here, let me do another save state. So this setup here, there's a... Uh, oh fuck, this beer on our plan. There's this Rex and this Chuck. And we want to eat this Chuck, like this way it's not possible, it's obvious. Um, <coughs> But with this Rex it's possible, so let me try to show off the easiest way um, with, uh, called the Virus Orb. Um, it's a really safe and easy way and well, obviously the uh, slowest one. So what you want to do is this. That was pretty fast, but what happens is the Rex when we're shooting it is turning into a coin. and the coin is sticking to Yoshi's tongue, and when Kumar uh, and when Mario is collecting it, then it creates a null item. But the game is still thinking there has to be something on Yoshi's tongue. And with going to the right, like jumping to the right like that, we are spawning this Chuck, which is gone now. And Yoshi is swarming it and gives us this beautiful thing there which is a ghost sphere, which is the same as in sunken ghost ship but it's looking really glitchy and shit like that <coughs> so let me turn on the slow motion it's looking really trippy on the video but i hope it's okay so the safest way is the virus orb you wanna be you wanna be on this pipe jump from yoshi kill the piranha plant and doing this like what I'm doing is I'm pressing X and A, I'm holding X to stick out the Yoshi's tongue and press A to spin off Yoshi and shoot a fireball to kill the Rex. That's the easiest way. Um, it's really important where you stand because if you're standing too much to the right like here, like you're spawning the Chuck too early and then it won't work because we really want to spawn the chuck when we're uh, after we collected the coin <coughs> so i would say like it's okay the setup for this is really easy, easy. you don't have to wait at all <coughs> you just want to go here jump up immediately yeah i would say because the rex is so close you want to stand uh, well something between here and here. Like the important part is not to sc uh, to scroll the screen like this. That's too far, and the chuck would spawn. So the second method I'm going to sh to show is the same way as man was doing it in the world record run. <coughs> it's the second fastest humanly possible T uh, orb. <coughs> it's kind of hard, but after some practice, you should be able to get pretty consistent. So let me just show it in uh, real time. So you wanna wait here for a little bit longer. 
a little bit longer and then you don't have to kill the piranha plant and then you save I would say something around 40 or 30 or 40 frames so we are saving time by not killing the piranha plant the important thing is you want to wait here for a little bit longer so the rex is close enough to you so you won't like if you don't wait for long enough then just this happens and it's not working so let me try to show that in slow motion so you want to wait here for a little bit longer than the virus orb go a little bit more to the right then the virus orb and then there you go that's a really like if you know how to do it like where to stand and how long you have to wait here then it's pretty consistent and not too hard you should get it after some prices like 90% uh, what I didn't mention is you want to crouch like the important part is to crouch so you won't get hit by the chuck because if you get hit by the chuck then the game will crash and obviously you don't want to crash the game so let me try to show that off crouch here well, you don't want to crouch too early okay, okay you want to wait for a little bit longer come on you also eat the fucking coin Like, you want to crouch to, to not get hit by the chuck. Wow. And obviously you don't want to get hit by this pure running plant too. Like, no matter which method you're doing, just crouch after you land it. So you won't get hit by the chuck. So now, so now I'm going to show off a method called Spinner Orb. Um, spinner, because you're going to spin off the chuck you're going to eat. It's like a really really hard way but after some time it's pretty consistent but it's pretty easy to crash the game but yeah what you want to do is you want to stand here for not too long okay that was obviously too long but... there you go um, the important part for this is standing for a little bit less long wow um right right here to so that the rex is uh, that the rex is not close uh, too close and the perennial plant is not too low and then you want to stand a little bit more to the left as the normal orb and the important part for the spinner of uh, for the spinner orb is not holding x and a because then you're going to be too high and the angle is bad then and then you just won't collect it and you don't like the reason why you wanna like the way I'm doing it is um, I'm repressing X and A really fast so you get a good angle to spin off the, the chuck <coughs> and yeah that's like the fastest way it's really likely to crash your game but uh, but you just have to practice the timing and where you want to stand and when you want to kill the racks and things like that and the angle is pretty important like too low and you will crash the game and too high and you just won't get the orb at all there you go. wow now i'm collecting the mushroom that's bad okay and after that you want to kill yourself why because it's slower to end the level because if we end the level we are going up to the yellow switched palace <coughs> and that takes a long time so you're just going to kill yourself you still have the orb and then we're continuing with the next level yeah okay so that was it for now and see you in the next level